In Hillsborough County, protesters gathered outside the commission chambers opposing any new mask mandates. Then the commission got an update on COVID cases in the county and found out the news is not good. News Channel 8's Megan Gannon is live for us in the Tampa News Center with more. Megan. Yeah, so health experts who spoke today told commissioners the Delta variant is spreading quickly in the county, but protesters argued that masks are not the answer. Bay Area doctors updating county commissioners that COVID cases have significantly increased over the last four to six weeks. It, it turns out that this is much more contagious. And so clearly the message, if you can't get it by the color, is the fact that we've had a dramatic increase. County leaders wanting to know what more they need to do to help mitigate the increase. There's not that many things in our toolbox right now to make a difference in the short term, but certainly masking and socially distancing is one of them. However, outside the county commission meeting, residents protesting that idea. Not in favor of the county's recent decision to require masks inside county facilities. We don't want businesses to shut down, we don't want lockdowns to come back, and we don't want the mask mandates to come back. But Dr. Jason Salemi says wearing a mask can help curb the spread and prevent things from getting worse. Dangerous when we let community spread stay high because the more opportunity that the virus has to continue replicating, it increases the likelihood that we could see other variants emerge. Now, county commissioners did not take any additional measures today, but they are opening up two temporary COVID testing sites starting this weekend to help with the demand. Now, it is a first-come, first-served basis, and all of those details are on our WFLA website.